Hi, everyone. Thanks for joining me for today's talk. There's an urgent situation unfolding in America, and today I'll unveil all the unnerving details. So let's get started with a critical question. Where were you on March 9th, 2022, when President Biden signed the death warrant on American freedom? On that day, in a hushed ceremony at the White House, without the approval of Congress, the states, or the American people, Biden signed into law Executive Order 14067. Buried in his order are a few paragraphs titled Section 4. The language in Section 4 makes Order 14067 the most treacherous act by a sitting president in the history of our republic. Because Section 4 sets the stage for legal government surveillance of all U.S. citizens, total control over your bank accounts and purchases, and the ability to silence all dissenting voices for good. In this new war on freedom, the Dems aren't coming for your guns. No, they're thinking much bigger than that. They're coming for your money. And it's already started. Hi, my name is Jim Rickards. I'm a former advisor to the Pentagon, the White House, Congress, the CIA, and the Department of Defense. I'm also an attorney, investment banker, and author of seven books on currencies and international economics. When places like Fox, CNBC, or Bloomberg want to know what's about to shake up the global economy, they call me. Most of all, like you, I'm a proud American patriot. The disturbing predictions you're about to see are based on my independent research and my contacts in the intelligence community. I've never made this kind of public announcement before, but it's my duty to pull the alarm. This is what I believe Section 4 of Biden's order means for all Americans. The U.S. dollar will be made obsolete. Soon your cash will be confiscated or will simply be worthless paper. The cash currency we have now will be replaced with a new programmable digital token. But the truth is, few outside the deep state recognize Biden's move for what it really is. If my predictions are correct, this is so much more sinister than simply replacing the cash dollar with a new digitized version. Friend, this new currency will allow for total control of all American citizens, because every digital dollar will be programmed by the government. That means they will be able to turn on or turn off your money at will. Not only that, but they'll be able to track and record every purchase you make. This is very different than online banking and has nothing to do with crypto. I'll explain everything in a moment, but what you need to know now is AOC has already publicly declared her support for a government-controlled spyware currency. The digital dollar means Dems would be able to punish any contribution, purchase, or even social media comment that they don't like. And this isn't something years away. It's starting now. Biden's secret army has been hard at work, and U.S. trials are already well underway. In fact, our government is racing to catch up. China and Russia have already launched pilot programs for their own digital currencies. More than half the countries in the world and almost 90% of central banks are testing or exploring a digital currency right now. In my opinion, it's not a question of will the U.S. implement a digital dollar. It's just a question of when. And the answer to that is it's already happening. Under Project Lithium and Project Hamilton, the new spyware currency has been quietly tested for several years. There's no stopping it. I predict we'll see a digital dollar in circulation next year or 2024 at the latest. But I do have some good news for you. It's almost too late, but you can still protect your assets and your freedom if you know exactly what to do. In the next 84 seconds, I'm going to outline everything for you. You'll see the ugly proof of their plan. You'll see what this could mean for you and your life savings. I'm also going to show you the only way I trust to protect your money and your freedom from Biden's new surveillance machine. I call it asset emancipation, and it's easy to do and understand. If you choose to take advantage of it, asset emancipation is a way to legally secure and even grow your wealth while hiding it safely away from Democrat surveillance and control. It's a loophole designed to outsmart a new spyware currency while potentially increasing your personal wealth. But you must know exactly how to do it, and that's what I'm going to show you today. I must warn you, some of this will be difficult to watch. But if you care about your money and your freedom, please do not turn away. Thanks to what you'll witness here, you're about to be much more prepared for the coming storm than your neighbors, and that's a very powerful position to be in. Imagine if you were German in 1923 and able to somehow avoid the 29,500% hyperinflation that made their money worthless. Or if you could have opted out of Roosevelt's confiscation of all private gold in 1933. That's the power of asset emancipation, and I'll show you everything right now. Thanks to Section 4 of Biden's Order 14072, ordering urgent research into developing the digital dollar, I believe the U.S. dollar, the standard of the world since 1792, will be replaced by a new currency, the digital dollar. 
These new electronic currencies are called CBDCs, or Central Bank Digital Currencies. I call the digital dollar Biden bucks because I want him to take full credit for what I consider to be crimes. This is not like the money in your online bank account. No, this is new and different. Every digital dollar will be a programmable token like Bitcoin or other cryptocurrencies, but there's a big difference. Cryptocurrencies are decentralized digital currencies. Instead, if it plays out the way I see it, Biden bucks will have the full backing of the U.S. Federal Reserve. They will replace the cash, fiat dollar we have now, and will soon be the sole mandatory currency of the United States. When Biden bucks are rolled out, many experts, myself included, believe they will begin an era of total government control and surveillance. This is not hyperbole. This would dramatically expand the power and influence of the federal government, essentially acting as a new type of spyware. With Biden bucks, the government will be able to force you to comply with its agenda, because if you don't, they could turn off your money. This won't be like freezing a bank account. It will be so much easier, because Biden bucks will be digital tokens programmed at the source. They could be turned on or off at will with just a keystroke, and they could be reprogrammed at any time. With Biden's secret surveillance army running the show, the anti-freedom implications are almost limitless. For example, Biden bucks could be programmed to allow only certain kinds of purchases. Imagine what this new world could look like. You want to keep an internal combustion engine car? Your digital dollars suddenly won't pay for gas. Instead, you can be forced to buy an electric vehicle. That's just the tip of the fascist iceberg. They can force you to get vaccinated. They can force you into solar. They can force you to use less water or heat. They can force you to eat fake plant-based meat. They can control where you are allowed to travel. They can stop you purchasing certain items like guns, ammo, or survival supplies. They can control to which candidates you're allowed to donate, and they'll know every single place you spend your money forever. America would become a surveillance state like China or North Korea. Every single aspect of your life could be controlled because they'll control your money. In fact, I fully expect them to implement a social credit rating system like in China. Say the wrong thing on social media, buy the wrong thing, subscribe to the wrong news channel, give money to the wrong candidate, and your rating drops. Suddenly, your Biden bucks are frozen or disappearing from your account. This is already happening in China. There, a low social score gets you officially labeled untrustworthy. They can take away your ability to travel, restrict your internet access, deny your family the best schools or jobs. They may even take away your pets. I'm not kidding. All this is going on today. But that's China, an oppressive communist country. Could this really happen in a democracy? Just ask the truckers in Canada, because that's exactly what happened to them. Their prime minister Trudeau was granted special emergency powers during the peaceful trucker protest over his forced vaccination law. He then ordered all banks to freeze the accounts of the protesters and anyone who aided them in any way. And it wasn't just a threat. That fascist froze the bank accounts of nonviolent protesters. He locked up over six million dollars in private accounts for protesting a forced vaccination law that truckers believe violated their sovereign human rights. Think about that. They protested his policies, so he took away their money. Think our current government would love to do that? Me too. Under Biden bucks, we'll lose many of our God-given American rights. They'll be replaced by total government surveillance and control. For almost all Americans, this would be the death of freedom forever. Almost all Americans, not you. You won't be a victim. You can beat Biden's surveillance army at its own game. The key is what I call asset emancipation. Asset emancipation was created to help you maintain and even grow your personal wealth, regardless of what happens to the cash dollar. Even better, it's designed to legally hide your assets away from government surveillance and allow you to potentially profit from the turmoil. For the record, asset emancipation has nothing to do with giving up your passport or fleeing the country. It has nothing to do with offshore banks or foreign currency trading, and you won't hear about it from your financial advisor because it's almost certain he has no clue about this loophole for legally opting out of the Biden buck surveillance program. I'll reveal everything in a moment, but I want to expose how deep this new conspiracy runs. Programmable currencies will soon replace all the cash currencies on Earth. More than half of countries and almost 90% of central banks are exploring or testing a digital currency right now. This includes Japan, Germany, India, France, the UK, Russia, Australia, Brazil, Canada, and China. In fact, China's new digital currency, the EU yuan, was used for millions of dollars worth of transactions.